Yo, what is up, my crazy subscribers? This is Joe King John City 4, and today I want to talk about Optic and the Call of Duty game. The reason why is because we all know how Call of Duty is pleasing the quick scopers, and we all are wondering why. Why is Call of Duty giving the quick scoping the big advantage in the past two Call of Duties? I mean, Black Ops 2, it was way too obvious because we all noticed how Von der Haar never, you know dubbed the freaking snipers i mean they were just too easy to quick scope even the baby inside its mother's womb can easily quick scope i mean that's how easy it was to quick scope in black ops to require no skills and for y'all quick scoping babies don't say no it, it, it required skill no it did not require skill i can easily quick scope myself too and i'm a rusher and I'm telling you right now, I've never quick scoped back in Black Ops 1 or in Modern Warfare 3. So, yeah, it was a big problem in Black Ops 2. So, um, we're all wondering, like, why? You know, why is the quick scoping community getting bigger and getting, you know, you no, know, every see, we see like a, a quick scoping player on every match. Why do we see that? Well, I just noticed that uh, there's a big you know, secret going around that no one knows. I mean, I'm the only one who, like, freaking broke it down on Twitter. If you guys follow me on Twitter, I said it so many times, and I was like, you know, I think I found out something that no big YouTuber out there has found out yet. Now, we all have seen the tournaments, right? We I mean, we all follow, we all follow MLG. We all follow these tournaments, like uh, where Optic plays and uh, Obey plays. You know, all these big quick scoping clans, but they play like with regular weapons. But uh, you know, these big quick scoping players participate on uh, you know those tournaments. Those tournaments where Call of Duty are watching and uh, seeing how the fan reacts towards these kinds of clans. And uh, we all know that. The quick scoping community have more fans on YouTube than players on Call of Duty. See what I'm getting here? Like, if they have over 1 million uh, subscribers on YouTube, you know, following Optic, well, there's like at least 100,000 people quick scoping in Call of Duty. And um, that's a bad thing. And this is what I'm getting to. If Call of Duty is trying to please Optic, and the reason why they're doing that is because they want to keep Optic and Obey coming back to their tournaments. That's what they want to do. They don't want to lose them. Since they know the game is dying, the only way they're going to keep players to coming back is by pleasing these two clans or other quick scoping clans into coming back by letting the sniping you know letting the, the snipers be easier to quick scope with that's the only way for them to keep coming back and that's the only way they will be able to do montages and let their fan base get bigger so that's why you know quick scoping will never stop in the next few call of duties because all they're gonna do their mission is let's please these two clans because they have the big fan base and hopefully their fan base will join too. So, uh, and this is the big thing. Only 25% to 30% of the Call of Duty community are quick scopers. The rest, 70%, are either other or rushers. So, um, this is why I don't get. Why they're trying to, why they're trying to please 30% of the community? Why? I mean... In Modern Warfare 2, people were mostly rushers. In Black Ops 1, you couldn't quick scope for shit. And a bet, and a bet Obey and an Optic were like falling apart because they couldn't quick scope for shit. Black Ops 1, it was made for rushers. Modern Warfare 3, it was made for strategical, you know, uh, maps, and uh, it was made for you to like advance in a very strategical way. And uh, you could have kind of rushed, but it was still a good game. It's just the lag and something else that messed up that game. It could have been a masterpiece. And uh, I don't know. Modern Warfare 3 had a chance to be a great game. But overall, it was kind of difficult to quick scope because you were very slow. I mean, I just took out quick scoping players like really easily on that game. And I had no problems and stuff. But uh, when it came down to Black Ops 2, it was just a huge mess. I mean, it ruined ground war everyone was just quick scoping the shit out of everyone and it was just a terrible 
mistake and I just got panic night right now on my game. God damn. Anyways, yeah. I mean I mean Von der Haar made it way too obvious because I know Von der Haar was trying to please these two quick scoping clans into staying. Cause I know Black Ops 2 had a chance into tweaking out the quick scoping community. I mean they had a chance. It's just that that update came around July. And that's where it just raises a big question. Why didn't Von der Hart do this earlier in the year? Why didn't they? Because they want to keep these clans to coming back. That's what they want to do. So, right now, I am blaming the quickscoping clans because they have a big fan base. Because this is what Call of Duty thinks. Oh, these two clans, you know, Obey and Optic, these quick scoping clans have a big fan base. You know what? Let's just try to play these two clans for right now because they have fan base. I mean, we know our game is dying, which I knew it was not dying because you guys fucking fucked up in Modern Warfare 3. I mean, it wasn't dying. It was a fun game. Modern Warfare 3 was a fun game. It's just that you guys needed to fix your fucking spawns and, and your lag, and it was going to be a great game. It was not because, oh, you know... We're losing fan base. We're starting to suck. And we messed up in Modern Warfare 3. No, you messed up on Black Ops 2 that you fucking make quick scoping easier. I mean, I'm just saying it right now, guys. Call of Duty. Stop pleasing these two clans. They don't make up most of the Call of Duty community. They don't. They just don't. 30% of the quick scoping community is like that big. 30%. That's 30% of the whole Call of Duty community. Why, why are you trying to please this small amount of crowd? I don't, I don't get it. You know, most of the fan base don't even play Call of Duty. They don't. They're just there for entertainment. <laughs> you see, and, and I do admit, quick scopers have bigger YouTube channels than rushers. When have you ever seen a rusher, you know, being been big in a tournament? You kind of rarely see one. You don't see like, oh, oh, you know, I remember this YouTuber. This guy's a great rusher in this tournament and blah, blah. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan of this guy. You rarely see that. You you mostly see on Twitter, oh, I'm a big fan of Optic. I'm a big fan of Obey. You know, this quick Scorpion clan, blah, blah. That's mostly what you see. But those fans don't play Call of Duty. That's the thing. They just like to watch them play and watch their do, watch them to do their, do their montage. So, um... Expect the next, expect this Call of Duty to tweak down the snipers until July. Expect the next few Call of Duties to have quick scoping on their games. It's never gonna change, guys.